Here are five easy ways to never achieve your goals. The first one is trying to be perfect. The fastest way to feel overwhelmed with anything that you do is trying to be perfect all the time. And what I think you'll discover by not trying to be perfect is that you're a lot happier because you let life happen as it may. It doesn't mean you're not trying to achieve a very specific goal or work hard. It just means you're not trying to force every single thing that happens in your life. Number two, try to do too many things at once. If I gave you six balls to juggle right now, would you be able to do it? Most of you are gonna say no. So just like that, I do not expect you to try to juggle six different healthy habits all at once. Start with one or maybe two. As you get really good at those, add a third, add a fourth, add a fifth, but don't try to rush it. The more you try to rush your healthy habits, the less consistent you'll be. Number three, not planning out what you need to do. If you wait to the last minute to try to get your protein, or eat a healthy salad, or get more healthy foods, or work out, or go to bed on time, you're constantly gonna be frustrated. Spend the extra 10 minutes it takes every single day to plan something out. Planning and preparing is freedom. If you're trying to do everything on the fly, it's gonna be very hard to stay consistent. I don't even remember what number I'm on. Number four, don't sacrifice the things you love when you're trying to lose weight. Just because you're trying to lose weight doesn't mean you can't eat cookies or cakes or pasta or whatever other things you like to eat. It just means you have to be smarter about your food choices 80% of the time. No one successfully loses weight and keeps it off when they eliminate all their favorite foods. So be as diligent as you can during the week and then have fun on the weekends when there's a party or a social outing. You still need to manage things and not go absolutely crazy, but over restricting yourself is not the path to freedom. Don't be the person who skips a birthday party because you're afraid that you're gonna eat all the cake. Trust me, you're not gonna eat all the cake. You'll be fine. Have a slice of cake, have fun, socialize, and think about the other things that are important for health, like being with friends, being with family, being with loved ones. I don't even remember how many I said I was gonna do, but let's end with number six. Take a deep breath. It's gonna be okay. No need to panic. You're not a failure if you miss one day. Just keep doing it. Keep learning, keep trying. It's a journey for a reason. There are no shortcuts on this journey. The more mistakes you make, the more learning opportunities you have. Be comfortable making mistakes. It might sting a little bit when you do something wrong, or you miss a workout, or maybe you eat 100 calories over your deficit. It's okay, relax. You'll be able to do it again next time. You don't have to starve yourself or fast for 58 hours. Just try to do it a little bit better next time. I promise you that with awareness and consistency, you'll get to your fitness goal a lot faster than constantly worrying about everything. As always, if there's anything more I can do to help you out, feel free to message me. Have a great day.